Assalamu alaikum dear friends, I am engineer Saifullah and you are here at Saver Engineer at Site YouTube channel. So my yesterday video was with for the WIR work inspection request, our request for inspection. And today I am going to upload a video or share a video with you for the MIR material inspection request. So in this video. I will fully uh, describe that how you will submit MIR material inspection request and which type of document you have to attach to the MIR and I will share also the format and I will tell you each and everything about the form how you have to fill it what is the inspection checklist for the material and that form and what are the relevant uh, document or important attachment uh, documents you should be attached to the MIR so let's go to the laptop screen so dear friends you can see this is the MIR page but let first I will tell you which type of document you have to attach for the material inspection request the first is the MIR page MIR form this is the MIR form after the MIR form you have to attach the delivery note of the material the material which you purchase from the market you have to attach the delivery note and after that there is MAR MAR mean material approval the request before purchasing the material the material approval request should be submitted to the consultant to get approval for the vendor supplier and material when you get approval for the material then you can go and purchase that material so when you have uh, going to submit the MIR so for that you have to attach MIR form delivery note and MIR of that material approval request of that material so let's come to the MIR form so guys this is the material inspection request MIR form here you have to put your company logo contractor logo here you have to put consultant and client logo this is the issue date origin origin mean here you have to write list like a document number most is done by the document controller but you have to know also origin you have to write here the short name of your company project fee you purchase order number division quality type of document MIR discipline several this is the MIR number if you are going to submit a revision like the first is the uh, uh, code CR rejected and you have to submit the revision so here you have to write the revision the one two three like that and you have, here you have to write the ITP reference number for the activity because when you are bringing the material uh, for any activity so you have to make ITP for that activity uh, activity as I discussed you in the ITP video and here you have to write the BOQ uh, reference number from the BOQ and after that here you have to write the project name in this area here you have to write the contractor name here you have to write the project manager name now this was the for the, uh, the detail now it's here the material inspection detail now here you have to click on the discipline for, for for which you purchase the material if you purchase the architecture materials we have to click on architecture but here and the double this uh, MIR form is for the several structure material for the steel so here I click on several and structure because it's a high yield steel bars if it's electrical you have to electrical mechanical electronics general like that if this is a new inspection so you have to click on new inspection if this is the revision so here you have, you have to put the revision date for the inspection and here you have to click on the re-inspection and when you are going to uh, click on the re-inspection so you have to attach the first revision of the inspection of the material also to the uh, MIR request here which type of attachment you are going to attach here independent laboratory test certificate factory acceptance test certificate certificate of origin other MAR so here I am going to attach the MAR and the MAR test certificates back to access acceptance certificates certificate of original all data about the material technical data sheet is available in the MAR document so here you have to click on others and write MAR now description of the material here you have to write the uh, details about the material so the the description of the material high yield steel bars ASTM 615 M60 for RCC work so the steel bar which we are using here for the RCC work is grade 60 steel as per ASTM 615 so you have to write just this and in the next here you have to write about the quantity so we were I'm 
I submitted this MIR for 8 mm steel. So here you have to write the bar 8 mm ASTM A615 mm grade 6420 tensile strength and 3 ton. This is the quantity of the material. Now come to the next page to put details about the material. So this is the submitted approval. Now here you have to come. This is the MAR for the steel. See, you can see it MAR for the steel material technical submittal submit for Raji Steel Industries. Okay, and this is accepted code B. So, here you have to take date from this area. See, and you have to put this date in here 11 21 to 2021. Okay, and this is the material uh, MAR number TDC. Uh, this is the MAR number for this document. So every document has a number like here you can see from here you have to take the submitter the reference number document number and this is the material approval request form. So from here you have to take the number and you have to put here in the MAR to give all the details. If you want to uh, uh, here write the relevant drawing number because where we you, we will use these details. So also you can the foot here the drawing number for the activity but it is optional model number if there is any model number for the material you have to put it here if there is any serial number for the materials you have to put it here derive date of arrival from side so when you receive this material you have to put it here from where you will get this date you will get this date from the de delivery node this is the delivery node so we receive this material on 21 9 of 22 21 uh, 9 and 2022 we received these material on this date so you have to put this date here a date of arrival site delivery note number this is an important thing so you have to take this delivery note number from the delivery right so this is this is the delivery note number so from here you have to take this delivery note number and put it in the MIR so origin of the country of this uh, for the material is KSA if this is KSA origin so you have to write case if this is coming from outside of the case so you have to write that the name of that country if this is case so no need to put here the origin certificate number but if it's coming out of the case so you have to write here the certification origin number and the company the supplier the or vendor or the company will provide that certi origin certificate number to you and you have to put it here storage location where you store this material you have to write here your steel yard or your store name manufacturer alaraji steel supplier is also alaraji manufacturer address is optional no need to put it here supplier name no need to put it here because here we already put it so here you have to write your contractor name signature and date let's finish class now material inspection this is the inspection checklist inside material form so when the consultant come he will he will check all of these things also he can check more he can check more things about he can ask for more detail but these are the basic detail which he should be checked at side before his coming you have to do the pre-inspection of the material a physical damage if there is any physical damage so yes if no physical damage no if not applicable to the material for the physical damage you have to write any and here you can ask your remarks here and he will also write his remarks if you are doing this internal inspection so you have to write your remarks if but if you are not doing the internal inspection so all these things will be this area is for the consultant detail give, given about correct all the details which we given here if it's correct correct so he will write uh, click on yes confirm with delivery note so right check here it is three tons so he will confirm it with the delivery note this is the delivery note see here the bar 8 mm to six meter length and this is the uh, two ton right and this is also another delivery note so and one deliver one ton is at that delivery note so because of that i write it here three ton okay confirm with approved submission so this is the approved submission number and this is approved submission for the material so he will check with this that it's a registered industries and the material is also a registered industry he will check this on with the delivery node she see it here RM so purchase money where is the supplier for this uh, the registered and 
it's come from the registry so he will confirm with the MAR that it's from registry and after that If there are any SCCS page part included, so he will click on yes. If not included, no. If not in applicable, so he will write any. Okay. And here he will write his comment in if uh, the material is approved 100%, so he will click on A. If there is any comment and approved with comment, so here he will write if the material is rejected, so he will write on click or he will click on uh, mark C. Comply with the comment and you have to resubmit the revision one for the material. So this was the form of MIR and here with this MIR when you build this MIR you have to attach the delivery node of the material from here you have to take the all the data for the delivery node number data and the rebar quantity and this is the MAR MAR material, material approval request for the material and you have to attach this and this MAR material this there is a like all the detail about the steel you can see here different test certification these are the uh, certificates of the company you can see membership certificate all the records are available all the steel industry registry is uh, different technical data yield strain normal weight tensile strength of the steel all the data are provided in MAR okay and this is a certificate, a certificate of registration all the detail about the material material company is available in MAR material approval request so inshallah I will upload next video on the MAR how to submit MAR what type of things you have to do and what type of things you have to attach with MAR so guys this was the video for MAR if you are new subscribe please like our youtube channel and uh, subscribe our youtube channel like our uh, video and comment your feedback on the uh, comment box and if you have any questions you can also ask the question in the comment box thank you so much for watching